on Fitness Friday today, an exercise for UEFA referees to train at their maximum speed. Curious what they do? Hi, this is Jan again from DutchReferee.com. I'll explain the exercise to train at a maximum speed. For this exercise, I use a few cones to mark where you need to sprint or where you need to go backwards. But you can also use the lines that are already on the field of play. And I'll explain you what you have to do. I've already placed the cones on the field of play. And I'll show you now what you have to do. You start in the corner of the field. You go sideways to the edge of the penalty area. Then you jog towards the cone just over the halfway line. Then you go backwards to this cone. And this is where the speed part comes. From this cone, you go to the goal area line and immediately back to the same cone on the other end of the circle. And after you've done that sprint, you mirror the same on the other side. So you go backwards again to the cone, then jog back to the edge of the penalty area, and then you go sideways to the last cone. On this area, you can walk back to the start. How long do you think it takes? Approximately two minutes. And UEFA referees will run this exercise six times. Then they do a four minute rest period. Uh, and after that period, they do this series again. Do you think you can do that too? Um, you can find the text of this exercise in the description below. And that's where I also try to share more exercises in the future. And if you want to see more on Fitness Friday, make sure to subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching this video again on Fitness Friday. I hope you liked it. And in the upcoming weeks, I'll try to explain a little more about fitness and how to improve sprint or how to work on your acceleration. Um, but if you have any questions yourself, uh, you can drop a message, message below. You can also send an email to Jan, that's J-A-N, at DutchReferee.com. I'm looking forward to hear from you and maybe share what your fitness challenges are. Thank you for watching.